Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's vlog it's going to be my book haul from Book Access So I was invited to visit Book Access Ritual at Dalmun Mall in conjunction of their 13th anniversary So thank you for inviting me Book Access and happy anniversary to you guys Okay, so I'm just gonna talk about what I got there Okay, so I was given the bag of goodies while I was there. So the first one that I got is this button badge that says words have power. And a sticker that says read. Which I really wish I could paste this on my forehead so I can remember to read every single day. And they also give, gave me this art therapy. Notebook. Um, it's sort of like a journal. It has pages where you can color it. It's really pretty. Yeah. I I already have quite a few journals already right now, so I'm not sure when I'm going to be using this, but hopefully soon. Because I really like it. Their pictures are very pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the books that I got. Curious? Much? So, the first book is I Believe in a Thing Called Love by Maureen Gu. I, always, I have always wanted to have this book because I have heard so much good things about it and people are saying it's a really cute and fun read so because I read I always read fantasy so fantasy mostly most fantasies have like a very intense plot so I do need some cute and light read so I think this one will be perfect for it it does mention about k-drama as well which I totally love so I can't wait to read this one. I really like the cover, it's so cute. The second book that I got is Dream Strider by Lindsay Smith. This one caught my attention at the first sight because I really like the cover, it's so so gorgeous. Look at the details. I just saw this one, this coral thing. It's very pretty. I love it. And it has something about dreams and nightmare. Not very sure, but it's fantasy. Totally my genre. So I am probably definitely going to love this. We'll see. The third book. That I got is Needlework by Deidre Sullivan. I actually am not sure at all what this book is about, but I really like the blurb at the back. You guys see it? Okay, I'm not sure, but I'm just gonna read it a little bit. I would like to make things beautiful, but a tawdry and repulsive kind of beauty. A braver sort than people have from birth. Sexy zombies on the bicep, that sort of thing. Okay, so this is the sentence that totally caught my attention. Sexy zombies on the bicep. I don't really fancy zombies, but sexy zombies? You'll definitely have to see that. Judging from the back, I think I'm gonna love this one. Can't wait to read it. The fourth book that I got is Jane Eyre by Charlotte Brown. Charlotte Brown thing? Okay, I totally am not sure how to pronounce the last names, so I apologize if I if I totally ruined it. Please let me know how to pronounce it if you know. So this is one of the most famous classics. So I have I have been wanting to read this one for quite a long time. So 
I'm excited to finally have it. And we'll see, maybe I can read it soon. And the fifth book is Gullstruck Island by Francis Hardinge. Ooh, look at that. Look at the font. I have read two books, two other books from Fr Francis Hardinge, which is The Light Tree and Deep Light. And I love both of them. I really like this author's writing style. It's pretty unique and kind of whimsical in a way. So I really like her stories. So I can't wait to read this one as well. It says, The lost are all murdered, each one leaving their body never to return. Something about death, dead people. I love. Okay, so the next book that I got is Ikigai by Yukari Mitsuhashi. It says that um, the word Ikigai is formed from two Japanese characters Iki meaning lie and Gai meaning value, of, value or worth. Put simply, it's the reason you get up in the morning. So here. Hmm. We'll have to see if this book is going to help me have a reason to get up in the morning because uh, it's so much better to sleep all the time. Okay, and then I was supposed to only be buying these six books but then just before I went out from the book fair I found this one it's crazy in love at the lonely hearts bookshop by Annie Darling this word bookshop I'm highlighting this I don't think I have any any books that revolves around that centers around a bookshop or at least a library so I was excited to be getting this one because I I really want to read something based in a bookshop or a library because books 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 I just need to have it this is the synopsis it sounds pretty cute in my opinion but we have to see if I'm gonna like it or not okay so these are the seven books that I got from Book Access Virtual at Diamond Mall. I bought all of these for only around 60 ringgit. Well, I got discounts for members and also got vouchers, of course. But still, to be getting that price for seven books. If you guys want cheap books, Good quality books, visit Book Access Show today. Don't forget to visit any of Book Access uh, stores. They're having a discount right now for members. You, defi you definitely do want to miss that. Come and join me with all these new books. Buy books and read it. And read it. So that is all for me today. This is probably boring, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have read any of these titles, please let me know in the comments. I would really like to discuss it with you once I've done reading it. So let me know. And yeah, that is all for me today. So see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching!